Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to day 766 of trying a new makeup product every day. Today I'm going to be trying out the Wet n Wild Mega Last Liquid Catsuit High Shine Lipstick, which I have been wanting to try this out for so long. I absolutely love the Wet n Wild Liquid Catsuit Liquid Lipsticks. I did a review video on the metallic version, which if you haven't seen that video or you're curious about it, I will have that video linked in the description down below. But I absolutely love Wet n Wild. So affordable, but they make such high quality products. Like this retails for $5.50 and it comes in so many different colors and they have a matte version as well. I got this in the shade Flirt Alert. And I love the doe foot applicator on these. So you can see it kind of has a little bend in it. I feel like that makes it very easy to apply. Yeah, no scent or fragrance to this, which is fine by me. But so it's, of course, cruelty free. Love that about Wet n Wild. But I also love that this liquid lipstick has so many great ingredients in it, like vitamin E, muru, muru seed butter for moisturizing, shea butter, sunflower seed, passion fruit seed, argon and macadamia oils. So lots of nourishing, moisturizing ingredients. So let me go ahead and start out by doing a swatch. Oh my gosh, that really is high shine. It seems like a lip gloss, but then with a very beautiful full pigment. I love this pink shade. But I'm just really curious how this is actually going to look on the lips. Like, is it going to be like a lip gloss texture? Let's find out. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It seriously, it applies like a lip gloss, has shine and feels like a lip gloss, but it's full opaque pigment like a lipstick. So it's kind of like I did a liquid lipstick and then a lip gloss on top, but then it's just combined into one product. And this color is so pretty. It's lighter on me than I was expecting but I think I still like it sometimes these light pinks can wash out my skin tone but I think this one still looks okay I'm not in love with it on myself I think it would look better on other people but I also kind of want to add one more layer because even though it is that full pigment I want to see if it gets any darker? It layers up, but you don't even need a second layer because it really didn't change the color, the amount of pigment, because it already had that full color and pigment. But sometimes if I feel like a lipstick isn't the right shade for me or it's too light, like in this scenario, I would maybe line my lips with a darker shade or a shade that matches my natural lip color more, put it all over my lips and then top it with this color if I want to make it so that my lips are less washed out. But this seriously is such a beautiful formula. So, so hydrating on my lips, like very enhancing. My lips look smooth. They look a little bit plumped up because of how shiny it is, but also it just got rid of any lines in my lips because it's so moisturizing. And I really do love this color and I love this shade. I'm just not crazy about it on me, but I'm gonna be honest, I'm kind of surprised that, and it keeps getting on my teeth, but I'm kind of surprised that this is the texture. I was kind of thinking that it was still going to dry down the way a matte liquid lipstick does and the 
other liquid cat suits that I've tried out, how they dry down, like a matte liquid lipstick or the metallic liquid lipstick has a matte finish. I guess I kind of thought this is going to dry down but still be shiny, if that makes sense. So it would be kind of like a layer but still have shine to it. And I'm a little bummed that's not, that that's not what this is. I don't even know if that type of product exists, but basically it's like a matte layer of liquid lipstick, but it still has reflective shine, but not in a metallic way. Let me know if you have any idea what I'm talking about and if a product like that exists. If not, it really should exist because then you would have your long lasting, all day lip product, lipstick that would have shine to it, but it wouldn't come off with eating and drinking the way a matte lipstick lasts. Like speaking of, let me do a kiss test. Yeah, like all the transfer, that's what happens with glossy products like this. And the color did fade, but that's bound to happen with a glossy product. But for a very pigmented gloss, this is a fantastic option. I absolutely love how it feels on my lips. It's not sticky and it's so, so nourishing. So I would consider this another Wet n Wild product that I love. <laughs> well, thank you so much for watching my video today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day. And I will see you tomorrow in my next video.